Hey everyone, I'm Zadek. Uh, welcome back to Control. Uh, so, I dropped some of the settings so that we won't be chugging anymore. Um, I was running at 2K, but I guess my GPU can't handle that with more recent games. So, we're running 1080p now. So that should fix it. My name is Dr. Chris, lead researcher of the Parakinesiology Department. I discovered Tone Omega Paranatural and residing within the Hero Area. Right under our noses. Darling refused to allocate me the budget or resources. So, so I'm taking matters into my own hands. What this requires is I need to convince her. Burn it. It's been talking to me for some time now. Listen. No record. I believe it. Oh, oh sorry. What? What do you need? I see. Uh, I'll try to find some volunteers. Volunteers. Oh. Uh -oh. Says. So Burn trash. Is it like By oh. trash? Did Ati mean barrels full of hazardous biological material? Probably. That sounds about right for this kind of place. Seems like they're breaking some environmental regulations on waste disposal, but oh, absolutely. if that's what Ati wants, then I'll get it done. <laughs> Ati gets what Ati wants. Is just big old barrel of hazardous waste. Man, there's a lot of them. Okay. Let's find the rest. Come here, barrel. Probably not in this room, honestly. That's no, it's just a normal barrel. <laughs> I was hoping that would like break or something. Whatever. Oh wait, no. Ah. I didn't know that was a lower floor I could get to. Here we go. Oh, I found you. I found you. Then there's one more. Oh, nice. Uh, let's see, where's this last one? Hmm. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Uh, mail tube complaint. Gee. Uh, mail tube complaint. Marshall. Let's go to unread. Mail tube complaint. Hey, Bozer. Get this. The accounting department still says they haven't received my expense reports. They say the receipts probably got lost in the mail tubes because of a shift or a threshold or some such fuckery. And if I don't find if I don't have the originals, they can't verify my expenses for reimbursement. This is such bullshit. Why do we even use these fucking tubes if they just spit out spit our mail out in some other goddamn dimension? 
Just venting here before I make a formal complaint. Useless pieces of shit. <laughs> that probably frustrated me too, though. Let's see, did this go in? No. There we go. Okay, so there's like one or two more in here. Uh, oh, there's one. That is not. I don't know why I didn't see that earlier. Oh, nice. Burn the trash. All right, now let's get these energy converters up and running. So we can continue the quest of main, the main quest. All right, uh, coolant pumps, I just did that. Power plant. Can I? Yeah, okay. It's a little dark, I couldn't see. Maybe I should turn up the brightness. That was, oh. Oh, okay. That looks, what is that? Oh, it's just a cut cord. Okay. Don't you drop down here, I, I swear. Let's see, where's the, that's the coolant pumps. Elevator. Ventilation. Elevator. Energy converter. Okay. Ah, damn it. Get domed. Get domed! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that's the elevator. That's why I couldn't get in. Alright, uh, let's see. We need oh, to fix this thing ASAP. Absolutely wrecked. I'm gonna turn the brightness up a little bit because. Control point. Ooh, this looks concerning. What is all that? Oh. Okay. I even need to bring this with me. You need to fix it before the old trick pants inside the plant has a shit fit. Has a shit fit. <laughs> Gotta say, Ati's my favorite character in this so far. Ooh, what's this? Documents, home safe tests. 
thought I have three on red all of a sudden. His charged. His trooper. Okay. <clears throat> the safe object of power can produce a barrier using objects or material from its immediate vicinity. See Object of Power 22 case file for more details. Bureau Rangers were given permission to employ heavy weaponry against a para-utilitarian bound to this object in order to gauge the barrier's durability. Redacted and redacted velocity ammunition were tested with redacted results. Testing will continue after redacted. The safe object of power is clearly a viable candidate for use in combat response scenarios allowing para-utilitarians to participate in altered engagements would be an advantage worth considering. Hmm. Okay. Alright, let's see. Uh, we gotta get these... Oh, sir, sir. <laughs> oh, sir, you're rude. Bruh, there we go. All right, and here. Oh, oh boy. I see you. I see you, fam. I see you, fam. Is there one more? No, not there. this guy with a box. <laughs> Oof. Really looks like it hurts, honestly. Let's go lift the lock down. Okay. Let's do it. Control room. Uh what's this? Coming game reminder. Next game is Wednesday at 8, usual spot. Hazard owes me 20. Arish still on a fucking winning streak. Someone please figure out how he's cheating. Thompson suspended for a game because of that shady dealing incident. Guy, I owe you $60. I brought beers last time, so it's Hepstenstall's turn. That's a cool name, Hepstenstall. Alright, uh... Where we go? Oh, crap. The Hiss doesn't like me. Oh. That's okay, because I whooped their butt. Get 
Rick. Haha. Uh -huh. I got you. I popped your booty hole. Ooh. It's like an old ICBM control room. To protect them. Oh. Forces contain the lockdown. Can only be lifted by a directorial override. This okay. is what we came here to do. Oh, okay. So much is expected from the director. The responsibility, the privilege, to steer the Bureau into dangerous waters and safely out again. To inspire and lead its people, to protect them. The board is there to advise you, but they want things in return. You hold all this in your own trembling hands. I had to lose everything before I could see the Bureau is the Director's life. There's no room for anything else. If the forces contained here escaped, we'd be dragged back into an age of superstition, terror, death. Assuming you think we have really left that behind. Any emergency. This security measure in my first years as a director. I knew the one time we made it. I didn't personally see the cause of sloppiness. I made sure the internal lockdown could only be lifted by a directorial override, only to be used when the director is confident the sectors are safe to be opened again. Hmm. This way, the director is the last line of defense. And if I screw up, See, now I'm suspicious of the, her name, Emily Pope, the researcher lady. I'm suspicious of her now, because brand new director, and I'm not supposed to undo the lockdown. I don't even know why the lockdown was caused, right? We don't know that yet, but we got to unlock it, so... What is this, the Shining Elevator? Jesus. Speak That's with it. Emily. The other sector should be open now. We can hope. I think it's time I told Emily why I'm here. I'll risk it. Mm. You two should get to know each other. We're bored countermeasures. They know how to use your soldiers, humans, toys. His rangers. Kill enemies in the executive sector with headshots. Service weapon in spin mode. Huh, okay. Okay, fast travel time. Uh, I'm, oh, I'm already here. <laughs> uh, let's see, um... Control executive, that's, yeah, that's where I'm supposed to go, right? <laughs> the rendering never happens. <laughs> Oh man. Maybe it's because I'm playing it on DirectX 12, I don't know. Jesse, you made it. And you lifted the internal lockdown. Let's talk, Emily. Yes, of course. Of course. Listen, of course. Emily. Screw it. Just tell her. No, I no eyebrows. I been completely honest. I have it on ultra settings on 1080p and there's no Dylan, 
When we were kids, we found an old slide projector in ordinary landfill. The slides created doorways to other places. Bad things happened. Came through. That's all she gets. The rest stays locked inside. But we found help. Through one of the doorways, we met something. A being. A being? What kind of being? It's hard to describe, but it... She helped us. We managed to turn the projector off. The bad things that came through the doorways were gone. After that, your people came. I tried to grab us. I ran away. They got them. I love them beyond. Bureau agents took your brother? Yes. He covered it up. No one believed me. I just want to find Dylan. I've been looking for him ever since. What happened to this slide projector? It sounds like another object of power. I thought you took it. The Bureau. Along with Dylan. I've never heard of it. But around here, I assume everything's classified. You know, I looked into the ordinary AWE case files after you mentioned it. Trench and Darling were both involved. A large area of the containment sector was reserved for it. The case hasn't been active for a long time. I have no idea if anything's still there. Can you tell me more about this being you found? Let's hope you two get along. She's been with me ever since ordinary. In my head. She let me you. I call it Polaris. As in a guiding star. Did Polaris know about the Higgs? If she got you in here in spite of the lockdown, she's very powerful. Which may help explain your test results. Your readings are incredible, Jesse. Now, cross-referencing with the database, I found two matches in Darling's old classified files. Unfortunately, I can't access them beyond the file codes. One was P6, referring to a prime candidate for a potential future bureau director. Uh, this was logged years ago. Dylan. Is that Dylan? The other match is on something called Hedron, which must be connected to these Hedron resonance amplifiers somehow. All I know is that Marshall went to the research sector to secure the HRA production after the his first attack. So, Marshall seems like our best lead on Dylan. I need to go after her. How can I get to the research sector? Use my key card. The sector elevator will take you there. Man, we skipped right over clearance level two. Marshall is the next step. What Emily told me about ordinary my powers being connected to things in the Bureau's past, I am so close to something. Do you feel it? Something's coming. We take turns to come for a visit. I helped you. You owe me now. And when time comes, I will come calling. Why do I feel like Ati is the thing that escaped? Oh. See an energy they say the new director can launch objects up to 20 feet. Bullshit. We've never recorded any distance over five. Obviously, you never read the P6 data. Why would they know about the P6 data? <laughs> energy converters entrance, okay. Energy 
converters up here. Key fist targets. to go up the stairs, god damn it. You can't get me up here, loser. Did I just like fail fail that? Oh crap, I actually fail failed that. Can I load? Oh man, that sucks. Bruh, that sucks. I didn't know I only had one shot at it. Okay, uh, I need to go now, um, hold on, parapsychology, okay, and parapsychology is pneumatics, dead letters, parapsychology, where is parapsychology? I don't know. Uh, where's parapsychology? Sector elevator, maybe that's Research sector? Yeah, that looks right. Cool. Central research. Somebody thought this video would make for great internal communications. I'm looking at you, Mr. Tomasi. So, this is where the magic happens. Anyway, I I've been here for 24 years now. I I've always been here. And then through those years, we've made astonishing discoveries, authored studies of great importance. And in all this work, there is one thing we know, and that's how little we truly know. Rest assured, we're committed to keep pushing the known laws and borders of reality, and to make the Bureau proud. So, welcome. Assuming you have the necessary clearance, and, and do follow the safety protocols. Read the manual. Otherwise, bad things will happen. <laughs> Alright, well, we made it. Huh? 
home of the Bureau's mad scientists. Why am I always interrupted when I try to end the episode? I don't know. Anyway, we're going to end the episode here. So we'll pick up next time. Thanks for watching, everybody, and see you next time.